Welcome in the new tutorial for Aspen Plus, where we will see how to add properties that are important for mass transfer. For example, if we, we want to estimate the overall heat transfer coefficient for an heat exchanger, we need to know the viscosity, density, thermal conductivity and specific heat for both fluids. The easiest way to do this is to create a property set that reports parameters of interest and then have Aspen report this property set. Open up the Prop Sets option under the Properties tab in the Data Browser window. In the Prop Sets window, hit the New button and then OK. Select the last box in the first column that is currently blank. In doing so, you will be present with a scrolling window of physical properties that Aspen can calculate. Scroll down until you find the desired properties. You will notice that a description of what each property is appears in the bottom window as you scroll over the options. Let's imagine that we want to calculate for the mixture the viscosity, the density, thermal conductivity, constant pressure, heat capacity. Now select the qualifiers tab. This window allows the users to input what phases they would like the property set to be reported for, or to set specific temperature and pressure values. We can select both vapor and liquid phase. We must now add the PS1 property set to the stream table that is shown on the process flow sheet. To do this, we must go to the report option windows under the setup tab in the Tata browser window. Under the stream tab, hit the property sets button. Select PS1 and hit the single arrow button pointing to the right and it will now be displayed in the stream table. After you have done this, close the property sets window. We can now run the simulation. Our final stream table is shown here and you can see all the transport properties that we have set before, both for vapor and liquid phases. For further information you can send an email or leave a message on YouTube. See you in the next tutorial, bye!